friends, I welcome all of you back to my Southern Kitchen and the eighth episode of Ellen's Chris Kwan series. Today, I'm going to share with all of y'all a cupcake recipe in honor of the movie The Color Purple, which come out in theaters on Christmas Day. I got my purple on. Instead of red velvet cupcakes, how does purple velvet cupcake sound? Oh yes, sugar. And my friends, it is so simple and easy to make. The bomb.com delicious. And we're going to frost it with a luscious cream cheese frosting. Mm -mm. Everybody's going to love and enjoy this and great dessert for the holiday season. And I'll post a complete recipe along with the instructions down below in the description box. And for more Christmas treats and cupcakes, check out my Christmas treats and cupcake recipes playlist and my previous video, Holiday French Toast Bake. I'll post a link to those down below in the description box. So grab your cupcake pan, your cupcake liners, and your purple food coloring sugar because we're about to bake some purple velvet cupcake magic in my southern kitchen. Here we go! Alright my friends, the first thing we're going to do is prep our dry ingredients in my medium bowl. We're going to add in two and a half cups of cake flour. And into our cake flour, we're going to add in one and a half cups of white sugar. And our level inks. One tablespoon of cocoa powder and one teaspoon each of baking soda and salt. I'm going to whisk these together or you can sift them if you like. All right, so now we're going to set the dry ingredients aside while we work on our wet ingredients. In my large bowl, we're going to add in two extra large eggs at room temperature. And then to our eggs, we're going to add in one cup of canola oil. Going to make the cupcakes super moist. One teaspoon of pure vanilla extract. That's a careful. A fourth of a cup of hot coffee. I'm using decaf or you can use the original. The coffee will help bring out the chocolate flavor. One cup of buttermilk at room temperature. And this is my homemade buttermilk. I'll post a link to that recipe down below in the description box. And of course, this is in purple velvet cupcakes without some purple food coloring. I'm using a tablespoon of the gel purple food coloring. I'm going to whisk all these ingredients together until they're well blended. And it's all in the dumpling bowl recipe. I love it. And you see how it's changing colors? Excellent. Now we're going to add in one teaspoon of distilled white vinegar and mix that in. All righty, now we're going to slowly add in the dry ingredients. All right, last of the flour. Mix this in until everything is well incorporated. All right, my friends, and just that quickly, our cake batter is complete. Look at this beautiful purple. Nice and vibrant. Mmm. Can smell the cocoa and the vanilla extract 
Smells wonderful. Now we're ready to scoop it into our cupcake pan. We're going to scoop them into my 12 cupcake pan. And I lined them with cupcake liners. So using my ice cream scoop, we're going to fill them up three quarters of a way. Just like that. And just scoop it into the cupcake liner, like so. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and finish with the rest of my cupcakes and I'll bring you back. All right, my friends, I got all my batter into my cupcake liners. So now I'm gonna bang it to get the air bubbles out. Now we're ready to put them in the oven. Oven's preheated to 350 degrees and we're gonna let it bake for 22 minutes. And I'll bring you back. All right, my friends, I have taken my cupcakes out of the oven mm, and it smells incredible. So I'm gonna let it rest in the pan for about 13 minutes. All right, my friends, I have removed my cupcakes out of my pan and off camera, I place them onto my platter and I'm gonna let them cool completely. And while they're cooling, let's get started on our cream cheese frosting. In my stand mixer with the paddle attachment, I have one 16 ounce box, which is a pound of powdered sugar, along with a pinch of salt, and I sift them together. And in two hour powdered sugar and salt, we're gonna add one eight ounce block of cream cheese and a half a cup, which is one stick, or eight tablespoons of unsalted butter, and they're both at room temperature. And a teaspoon of pure vanilla extract. We're going to mix all these together until they're well incorporated. All right, my friends, our cream cheese frosting is complete. And our cupcakes is nice and cool. We're ready to pipe and give it some sugar. I have placed my frosting into a piping bag using my 1M star piping tip. So it's gonna pipe the cupcake all around, like so. Alrighty. And I have some crumbled cupcake pieces, just gonna sprinkle them right on top. Now how good does that look? All right, I'm gonna go ahead and finish piping the rest of my cupcakes and I'll bring you back. All right, my friends, there you have it. Purple velvet cupcakes. Don't they look good and pretty? So now I'm about to fix me up a plate and I'll give it a taste. All righty, my friends. Now it's time for the best part, the tasting. Here we go. Mm-mm, look at that. Have a bite. Mmm. Look at that texture. It's so moist. Tender. And that cream cheese frosting is divine. These cupcakes are scrumptious, my friends. Please give this recipe a try. This deserves another bite. Mmm. -mm. Yum o. Oh. Purple Velvet Cupcake Licious. My friends, I want to thank all y'all for watching and joining me in my Southern Kitchen today. If you enjoyed this recipe, please give it a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to share this with your family and friends. Like, comment, subscribe to my channel, and click on the bell so that way you'll be notified when my new videos come out. Also, follow me on social media. Facebook, Ellen's Homemade Delights, and Instagram at Ellen Delights. And don't forget to hashtag Ellen's Homemade Delights. And remember, the color purple come out in theaters on Christmas Day. Wear your purple. And I'll see you next time. Let's eat. Much love. Merry Christmas. And happy holidays.